回到印度，我觉得有一件很让我个人很难忘的事情，实际是我们的那个体验店的开业。然后我我整个上午都是忐忑不安，因为那是我们第一次在印度，然后一个新的体验店，就是一直心里没底。然后我就我就问我们同事，我说：“哎呀，对呀，不停的问有有人吗？有人吗？”试盘时间没到，就外面已经排了很长的队伍。然后整个那一天应该是有上千人在在那个地方排队。那个时候啊，让我非常非常难忘。One plus. Is the number one premium phone brand in India. It's amazing. I need to understand better what drives them. We need to understand that as a team. The first time around, it was all kind of gut feeling, but now the stakes are much higher because we are launching something off the shoulders of the OnePlus flagships. And if we don't succeed, we probably don't have another shot. Because you only have one opportunity to make a first impression in the market. Before I joined the brand, I was a customer. I have been a customer since the OnePlus One released. I remember buying the OnePlus One when it first launched into the country, and I was really excited because only a select few people knew about. Uh, the phone, a phone that's giving you the best hardware specs that there is, and then, and being able to find a community that、uh, likes and enjoys the same tech, was fantastic for me. And this brand was really trying sincerely to、uh, reach out to its consumers and understand what they want and what they like、uh, in, in a smartphone device. And it's not just、uh, being pushed onto them. I know we're in, because I've been in India for about four years. 四到五次去印度，然后每一次去，我们都看到，真的，我们那些用户对一家产品的那喜爱，我们丰富我们的呃产品线，能够让更多的印度的用户能够用到一家的好的产品。其实这个也是我们做这个 Note 这个产品线的很重要的一个原因。Why is OnePlus a, such a you know well-liked brand here in India? What do, what do you guys think? Yeah, I think the invite system, all of that, it was just different. So you probably had a very similar product, a very good product. Of course, that's a backing, but managed to cut across, right? Because you were different. Because we've been in the premium category for the six, past six years here in India, we don't know how consumers think、uh, in other markets. So we're going to go to Gaziabad, but we actually don't have any planned、uh, itinerary for, for our day there. <laughs> And then、yeah, I'm just walking around stores and talking to people, but we know nothing about that.、Um, how can we find out more, or like, where do we go? What phones are selling well right now? iPhone, Vivo, Samsung, Mi, all phones selling. All phones selling. Yeah. How can we help you sell more? Uh, you can give some accessories in box. Phone, Do people are they asking for that? Yes.、Sir. We're showing up unannounced in stores, checking out how we're selling our phones and our com- competitors are selling theirs. And when you launch towards a new target consumer, you need to understand them. Hi, nice to meet you. Why is there nine people working here? Nine people. So、yeah. we have five people in sales,、uh-huh. uh, two in executives, in、uh, cashier, and one coffee. We're、uh, finding things that we can improve. Like, for instance, our logo here is very squished. You see it? It's like super squashed. 进入印度市场的时候。那么我们那我们那时候的观点，是，印度的消费者，他们希望拿到的就是一款好的手机，好的产品，啊，所以呢，他们对于硬件的要求，你可以看到的是比较多的，那么印度的消费者呢，他们在购买手机的时候，他们会
多方面的去啊比较啊，他们会详细的去了解你的手机的配置和参数啊。那么他们只希望呢，他们花的钱在手机上花的钱呢，能够物有所值。It's an aspiring culture, like we learned that today.、Um, and they like to belong. They like to signify their identity through their products. What I use is who I am.、Um, so that's quite interesting, I think. Primarily, what I do is I do a lot of research into the kinds of trends and and, and behaviors、uh, our consumers have. The idea of this focus group discussion is to figure out the right fit for the Indian consumer,、uh, and and we cannot do that without having their feedback on the process. So yeah, that's that's really the main reason we are having this、uh, focus group discussion. Check.、Mm. Drum. My first phone was when I gave my tenth boards, my final exams for my tenth grade, and I got a 9.8 on 10, and they were very happy. And then I got a phone that, which was my phone. I still didn't have it all the time because my mom used to keep a monitor on how many hours I used to use it. When I had dedicated hours for studying, I had to give it to her. <laughs> We've now prepped the the focus group material.、Um, We've developed different ways to present ourselves. And、uh, the focus group starts actually at six, so so we probably should get going quite soon. You can't take the picture. Where's your Where's your phone? You can't.、Yeah. Who do you work for? Don't take any pictures. There's Kenneth. My name is Jacob,、uh, and I, I、uh, I've been working、uh, for some time with 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 OnePlus.、Uh, I'll, I'll moderate this session today. What do you feel instantly? And please pass around the microphone. And, and what kind of feeling do you get? Um, lots of colors and、um, kind of catches the eye. I feel the photos are so clear. People like cannot afford DSLRs. They would like a phone that has a good camera quality, so they can you know click. They can be like amateur photographers or something. This is a very low trust market. No, nobody trusts anything,、um, especially from locals. So you, you see people saying the local influencers. Nobody trusts them, so we need to make people feel more safe somehow. Second is the features and performance, very very important in this market. And the third is、uh, messaging needs to be even more simple and direct. You got to remember that testing can only be used as an input to help you make a judgment, and you can't use testing results as a judgment on its own. If Henry Ford was to test a car in a time of horse and carriage, I don't think the testing results would be very helpful.